Hello YouTube people, let's fix this Logitech G203 squeaky mouse straight out of the box. This is horrible, but it's very easy to fix and this fix actually lasts for a very long time, like for years. You won't need to do that again for years. And this mouse afterwards feels wonderful, feels expensive, feels very solid. Here's what you need to do. So let's get to work and fix the squeakiness of this mouse. For this kind of work I use this hand towel as a surface so I won't lose those tiny screws so easily. Also you will need a tiny screwdriver, a cross pattern, very tiny screwdriver. Also you need these cotton uh, q-tips and some very fat, very fat industrial grease to lubricate those squeaky parts. And the sad part is that there are two screws hidden beneath these sliding pads. And after removing these sliding pads, I think it, it, you, you will need new ones. Uh, you can try glue them back on with super glue, but I don't think, don't think that's gonna work. So there are three screws to remove this one and these two. I have also already removed that one, so let's remove these two. You don't need to remove them, like take them out, just unscrew them. You feel when they start skipping. So that's, that's it and that's it. Take the top part off. Now, let's put this apart, away for a while. Now let's take this one apart because there are also some squeaky parts inside of this one. There are three sc screws that you need to remove. This one, this one, and there is one inside this little hole. So let's remove these two. And now this little screw inside this hole. Yeah. And now it should pop off like that. Now anything else you don't really need to disassemble. If you would like to remove these buttons as well and put something soft underneath them so they wouldn't make this noise, you all would also need to remove these four screws. It's very simple. But for, for fixing the squeaks we don't need to do that. So let's start fixing the top squeaky part. So let's lubr lubricate the Q-tip just a tiny bit, a little bit. And let me show you what parts you need to actually lubricate. So these are the parts that are touching and rubbing and squeaking. These parts that the screws screw in. So lubricate those. Yeah. These parts. I need a little bit more of the grease. Right. Also, the old perimeter also touches touches the mouse. So I'm not lubricating this part. I'm actually lubricating this part. So all perimeter is from from these sides where buttons touches to these parts. Everything lubricate very well. A little bit more grease. We will be able to clean off the excessive grease once we assemble the mouse back. So don't be afraid to use a little bit too much. Not a big deal. Yeah, and all the perimeter. Lubricate very well all the perimeter of the mouse. Like such. And there are also this little part sticking out which also rests on this part on this part to lubricate that a little bit also these two little things also the touching and they also can be squeaking let's lubricate them so it's all all the perimeter is lubricated that's great these oh, all six of them are lubricated that's great now that's it, let's put it back together and there shouldn't be any squeaks. So let's put it back together. And how to put back these tiny screws? First of all, 
you put a tiny screw back on your screwdriver. If the size is correct, the screw should stick on the screwdriver like that. So there are three points we have to screw them back in. Don't tighten up them too much. It's not necessary. Don't over tighten them. And the, tr the tricky one in the middle. That's it. No more squeaks from this part. Zero squeaks. Okay. Now let's put this part back together and screw the screws back in. Now the final result. Does it squeak anymore? Nope. No squeakiness. That's it. This mouse feels in the hands like it's three times more expensive than it was. I'm, I'm really pushing. I'm, and I'm very close to the to the mouth. Listen. You hear? Now let's, let's try squeeze it. That's it. We fixed the mouse. Now clean off the edges, all the excessive grease and that's it, you have yourself a wonderful, very good quality feeling mouse.